Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Painkiller. It has been a while, and I'm sure Daniel is eager to get back in the action, so we're not going to waste very much time here. <clears throat> One of the most important things that we need to do for this level is get back our Soul Catcher. Because, uh, let's see. For this one, yeah, we need to morph into demon form at least three times. So that should be quite doable. Now, since I have upgraded to the Black Edition since my last recording, uh, I've encountered this interesting little problem here. It seems that loading screens, uh, how fast they load, is now somehow tied to frame rate. Because if I have my frame rate locked, like it is when I'm recording, or if I were to turn V-Sync on, the loading screen does this. Where it very, very slowly, slowly works its way up. And it'll continue at this pace till it finally reaches the top and actually loads the level. So the only solution is to unlock the frame rate or stop recording at these sessions, so that's what I'm going to be doing from now on. But anyway, I believe we're just about ready to go here. Alright. Hopefully I won't encounter any choppiness. Now I have played this level a few times already. Um, I did do an attempt at recording way back before the break. And also my attempts to get my software working correctly. I do a few more recordings this time. So I know where a few things are hidden. I have a general idea of where to go, which is always nice. Now what's strange is uh, there's ammo boxes in there and I have no idea how to get to them. That's not really important. There's more than enough ammo in this level. Decide which weapon I want to use. It's always hard to. Especially when you start with so little ammo. Stake gun is kind of just the default because of how powerful it is. Hey guys! Now, the fun thing about this level is all the enemies have projectile weapons. Almost all of them. If you aren't moving uh, perpendicular to them, you're going to get hit a lot. It's pretty easy to die in this level. Stop paying attention for just one second, you're gonna get shot. Take care of these guys. You can see they're even just trying to speed up to him. That's gonna be a barrage of what I assume are rivets. After all. It makes sense for a dog worker to be using a ribbon gun. Come on, give me those souls. I need them. Where's this last one? I see. Oh, right in the tummy. Always an unfortunate place to be shot. Oh no. I lost it. We have 27 souls out of the possible 30 right now. Okay. <clears throat> Seems like something's stuck in my throat today. It's very unfortunate. Yeah. More frozen Legos. My favorite kind of ammo to collect. 
Uh, which one was it? Right, it's control that fires out the painkiller. And shift that fires the grenade launcher. Oops. I don't want to collide with those things. I might explode them. Alright, now we're loaded up. This is pretty much one of the best weapons to use for this level. Because it's hit scan, high fire rate, and good damage. I'm going to be doing a lot of distance fighting. Also has a built-in rocket launcher. Always a fun time. You know if you can actually hit anything. Problem is how it eats through ammo. Why can't I just have infinite ammo? Yikes, take cover. You stand still so I can deal with you. How do you get over there? There we go. Don't want his soul to get stuck up there. Ooh, I almost picked up that armor and I shouldn't have. Not too bad, not too bad. Uh, I don't believe there are any secrets around here. Let's just move onwards. Hold on a minute, no, that's just a wheel. Just a wheel, no big deal. Yeah, this part can be a bit tricky because it's very easy to get snuck up on. Also, these guys. Come on, give me your soul. Jeez. Diagonal fun and hopping. See, this guy's trying to sneak up on me. Why would he do that? Close to the threshold. I could have also taken that one that allows you to morph at 50 souls, but let's see. I believe there's more than enough monsters in this level, even if I miss a good amount of souls. I should be able to collect enough. Yeah, I'd have to miss about 60 souls or a bunch of monsters to not be able to uh, reach the goal for this level. Speaking of, where's this last guy? I 
think he might be one of those grenadiers. case there seems to be two of these guys and a grenadier. Alright, next battle is going to start off with a bang. Or, you know, there will be a few more guys and it will just kind of ruin everything. Check it out! You're just an assortment of body parts now. That one's stuck in a fence. Bit of a waste of demon mode, but what can you really do in a situation like this? I'd rather not miss any souls if I can avoid it. Doesn't seem to be any more ammo. Actually, there might have been more... Oh, I have a full minigun. Alright, what's going on over here? Oh yeah, this is where, uh... You get a lot of rotten dudes. there, guy. What are you doing? Standing on top of explosives is dangerous. That looked kind of painful. his soul, too. See that armor there? I don't want to forget about that one. I forgot about it in one of my test runs, and I was very disappointed. Time to head upwards. Nobody ever gets that one. Okay. Right, this one has a ladder on the side. It's not really important. Just something I would point out. I wanna... Can I control the crane? There's no controls in there. Maybe the crane has a mind of its own. Okay. I'm gonna hit a quick save here because... I think they're tricky to get around. There might be something hidden on top of that. Uh, ooh. Okay. I actually can't see if there's anything hidden on top of that building, because doing so would likely propel me to my death. You can look from here. No, I don't think there's anything up there. I'm just going to make the jump to this crane. Land on our happy little marker here. And this point... Uh, this battle arena down here is actually completely skippable. If you were to say jump to this rooftop, you would completely miss out on fighting on the boat. That's something I did before when I realized how easy it was to miss the objective for this level. My armor's back there when I want. Alright. 
cool. Whoa. I like these guys, they give me red souls. That's a lot of help. Bad spot to be stuck in. I'm getting shot from behind too. With no armor, that's doing a lot of damage. See if I can get that armor right now. Oh, that's gonna be tricky. I have to be up on the main level, on the deck, so to speak. And if I jump too far, I'll end up in the water. It's totally worth it for golden armor. I'm gonna take a few tries. Could have been worse. Could have been much better. Maybe these guys will eventually converge on me, too, and then I won't have to go hunting them down. I explode you. How terrible. Ow, don't shoot me. It's very impolite. Do you know who I am? I'm Daniel Gibson. I'll collect that machine gun ammo on my final loot. And hopefully kill the last guy? No. Looks like he's still inside the boat. Oh no. Hey there, guy. Still hear someone moving around. go. Maybe I've already picked up his soul. Let's pretend that's the case. So right now I have about 96 of 102 souls. I can accept that. Here's the other armor you can possibly collect in this area. It's not quite, well, not even close to as good, really. Glad I got the gold. Completely full of steak. I'm actually full up on most ammos. Oh yeah. Sometimes it seems like you're not doing damage when you hit them. Oh, now I'm getting spit on by drunks. That's not a pleasant experience. Oh, 
Most likely exploded out of the train car there. It's gonna happen some more in the future. I thought I could uh, climb up on these. We just need more momentum. Enough momentum to crush a kitten. Ah, okay, maybe not. Whoa, what's going on here? Get away from me, man. Oh no, I need that soul. Pardons. Yeah, you see what I mean? Sometimes it feels like you're hitting them in the right spot and you kill them pretty quickly. Other times, it seems like they just uh, shrug off any bullets you shoot. Probably just where you're aiming, but I can't quite figure out uh, where I should be aiming. Crotch seems to be the place to default, though. Relatively center mass. Alright, where is everyone? Oh no, you caught on fire because you were too drunk. That is the perils of drinking, my friend. That is a bad grammar, my friend. Oh, I'm nearly full up on most ammos. That one doesn't fall down. Missed my jump. Everyone must explode. Give me your gold. Get back your gold. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I'll deal with you in a minute. Did not have the right angle or momentum. Here we go. There's really much you can do up on these containers. Whoa! Pardon me. I'll be with you in a moment. Just need some souls. Whoa, okay. Make good use of this. Okay, guess who we've got in these containers? Yeah. So, uh. <laughs> Oh, I don't even care if I missed out on a few of those. It was totally worth it. So we've got 156 kills out of 261. We only need 59 more souls to get our final demon trigger. Whoa, well, no. demon trigger. What do they call it? No, oh, just demon. I was thinking devil trigger. Now. 
no idea how to get those two items there. However, I do know how to get the holy item up on those stairs. So let's do that real quick, like... Actually pretty simple. Help to have a bit of flashlight. I want to do that, though. This really dampens your chances of getting the holy item when you uh, fall off. Come on now. Now I'm just being silly. Hold on, I know what's wrong. Yep, just couldn't do it with my minigun out. I see you up there. Oof. Okay, we are now actually full on ammo. Which means it's time to use the shuriken gun. I don't know why, I really like this gun. Still no idea how to get that. Actually, this might even be a good spot for it, too. rockets at me. I don't care how many there are in your pockets. Oh, those screams. So amusing. I don't really know why, but the shuriken gun is great for dealing with large groups of enemies at close range. It seems to have a very good stun on it. Of course, the shotgun's also very good for that. The shotgun's good for everything. Need a can opened? Just use your shotgun. Oh, right. Welcome to being shot a lot. Pro Station JR, and I'm getting shot a lot. There's our last little friendly friend. Oh, I see him. Ow. Now it's important in this part to make sure you're walking on top of the trains. Because otherwise you might have to walk normally.
Oh, I feel like I missed something. I did miss something very important. Oh well. I suppose one way to get that would be to jump off here onto that roof and fall onto it. If you need the health that badly, you're not going to survive the fall in the first place. Alright, where did we end up? We ended up up. Yes, and there's also help on this roof here. Let's grab that real quick. I mean, we probably won't be grabbing the health because I'm at 234 at the moment, but there's some other goodies up there. Electroshock and armor. I think it's even golden armor, too. Oh, yeah. That's nice. Whoa, I can go up to 250 with that. How about it? Alright, now this is fun. This is the most fun part of this whole level. Remember last time when I fell onto a hanging uh, shipping container? I have to do the same thing, but I don't have a really good place to drop from. Okay. Ninety percent of the time I don't aim this right. Okay. Oh man. Physics. Not to be confused with physics. Oh no. <laughs> Let me out of there. Let me get this quad damage upgrade, because that's what I assume it is. Don't these guys look like they're being damaged four times? Stop rocket jumping. Ah! I almost don't care about losing their souls. It's just so amusing to see them fly up into the air like that. Actually, no, I really do care if I'm losing their souls. No, I still have 67 enemies. I'm just paranoid. Where's my minigun? My favorite minigun. Then I'll want more. I didn't even shoot a stake at you. How'd you get stuck in the wall? Mm, might not have been worth trading my gold armor there. But it's too late to worry about that now. Okay, we need a good indoors weapon. Electricity. I think 
Fungus Demon is pretty good indoors. Just a pile of body parts. What have I done? Look at this. This wasn't here before I arrived. I mean, gore, of course. Okay, but really, indoor weapon? Shotgun. It's not locked, I already completed that. Um, here, what's out here? Oh no! Man overboard. Send the soul raft. We need his soul. So much for that. Oh, looks like I missed out on whatever was upstairs there. Not they not make that mistake again. I will. Whoa. Dock workers do not belong on boats. Boats are for drunken sailors. It is important then. Let's listen to Here we have, for our viewing pleasure, the. Does that say painkiller or main killer? Can't even tell. No, I really can't tell. I would assume it's painkiller, but it really looks like an M. Shurikens up here. Got not much down here. So I think it's shuriken time. Ninjas versus pirates, it seems that ninjas win. Direct weaponry goes. She gonna explode? There we go. Oh yeah. Fire extinguishers explode. I don't think that'd be very helpful for extinguishing a fire. Hey guys, have a grenade. I'll be with you in a moment. Uh oh, this is really not a good situation to be stuck in. Turn this door advantage. Okay. Looks like that was the level. We finished by taking control of the bridge. This is our ship now. And all the cargo with it. And all the 
chairs. We've got a cargo of chairs on this ship. Electric chairs. They're all electric chairs. Okay. No, seriously, this is way too much fun. What an old style wheel for. Seems like a new ship. Oh, I missed two monsters. How could that be? We've got the Golden Card Confusion. That's interesting. I don't think I've ever played with this card before. Alright, next time on Let's Play Painkiller, The Old Monastery. See you then.